I'm gonna do it this way this time. another edition of the Dare John Letter, where you can dare John Dare to dare to do. I'm your host, John Dare, the genuine article. We're coming to you live tonight, as always, from John Dare's house, the fortress of mystery and power in Leeds, Alabama, City of Valor. Um, can't wait to show you guys what I've got up my sleeve tonight. Um, quite literally, we're going to be doing the Crickets Challenge tonight. And maybe it won't be so bad. They are, after all, bacon and cheese flavored. Um, this was actually the uh, the runner-up when we had uh, a generous donation uh, a few weeks ago from Orlando and Crystal. Um, they donated the crickets, the larvets, and the toe of Satan. And we had a poll to choose what John Dare would chew. And um, the, the, the toe of Satan, you know, it, it won in kind of a landslide victory. But second place, um, the runner-up was the crickets. And... So that's what we're going to do tonight, and um, well, thank you for everybody that tuned in last week when I did the uh, Tarantula Feast. Um, that was a Dare John letter, uh, a Dare sent in by uh, Greg Hanley, and it was made possible by uh, major contribution nations, contributions, what was it? Contributions. Con con contributions is what it really is. But we, you know, actual people sent in actual money to make the Tarantula Feast happen, and it happened so fast. We, Dave, Barry, Mia, Leah, Stroud, you know, I had to, I had to tell people cut it off, shut it off. We're, we've reached the goal. We've, we've raised the twenty nine ninety nine for the, the tarantula jerky. And I, let me tell you what, it was not what I expected, <laughs> and it was not good. But that's another um, challenge conquered. And um, you know, in a way, I, I think this is going to be worse because I mean, look at these. I mean, these are just, these look like they they could be alive. These look like they just died. These aren't cooked, dehydrated. That, that, that tarantula, that was supposed to be jerky, which I kind of expect jerky to be kind of chewy and, you know, a little moist. This, the tarantula last week was just totally dry, crunchy even from just being so dried out. And I mean, maybe, maybe these are going to have a little crunch to them too. Maybe a little snap, crackle, and pop. Um, Come on, refocus. But, uh, you know, I, uh, I think I'll light me some Saturday morning tunes and pour me a big bowl of these. Um, we've got the summer mojo burning here, which is what I chose for last week's episode. I thought that would, um, go with the tarantula well, but, you know, actually for tonight, I think we need to go with the Saturday morning tunes here. This is one of my very favorite scented candles from Red Beard Redolence. Uh, these are soy candles poured here by Nick Bailey, Nick and Ashley Bailey in Leeds, Alabama. And uh, anyway, this this will take you back to Saturday morning. The kid, you get up and watch your cartoons. Um, pour you a bowl of cereal. I'm gonna pour me a bowl of crickets your here. Your first bowl of cereal. It's <laughs> Saturday. You're getting three. Well, I'm only gonna have one bowl of of the bacon and cheese crickets here. Again, this was donated from Orlando and Crystal. They picked these up at Pepper Palace. Um, oh, okay. They're, they're good. They're all, sealed for you. Looks like there's seven of them. Sugar smacks. <laughs> yeah, they do kind of look like. Can't get enough super golden crisp. And they got the crunch with punch. These get do, in, in fact, have the Ooh. crunch. Um. You know, so, I mean, yeah, these are just crickets. There's nothing. They're not chocolate-coated. They're not, uh, they're not cooked, I don't think. 
Um, it says ingredients: crickets, archetta domestica, whey, cheese blend, cheddar cheese, milk, salt, cheese culture, enzymes, whey, salt, disodium phosphate. You know, and this is all this extra stuff that's after crickets is probably like non-fat dry, non-fat dry milk, natural and artificial flavors, onion it's powder. It's all powder. So it's all yeah, some kind of powder. On it. Not recommended for people with a shellfish allergy. So, like the uh, the tarantula had a warning uh, mm -hmm. for uh, crustacean allergy. This says not recommended for people with a shellfish allergy, and it says the other green meat. Uh, and then it it shows you the different cuts of cricket. I guess you've got your rump, your flank, uh, drumstick, <laughs> drumstick, wing, and breast. So. I don't think we'll be adding these to the menu at a certain chicken shack anytime soon, though. But, you know, may hey, maybe these are going to be indescribably good. and Who can know? But, uh... You can definitely follow Nick Bailey on Facebook or the Redbeard Redolence site on Facebook if you're wanting to find the candles. I don't know if there's a website. Well, what's the website? He does. It's redbeardredolence.com. And oh. I've, I've shared If you scroll back on my page, you can find it. Or maybe I'll share it again after uh, after the show here tonight. Um, I'm assuming you've got people commenting, asking. Yes. Uh, how many viewers are we at tonight? Okay. Well, that's not too bad. That's pretty good. We didn't do we didn't do much advertising the last couple of weeks. We put a lot of thought and effort, and and um, tonight we're kind of taking it easy on the right. John letter here. That's just so much going on. These we got our days. hardcore fans here, though. Yeah, and we appreciate y'all. Absolutely. You know, thank you again, everybody that contributed. Uh, you know, for your dares, that, let me maybe make a point here. How does one dare John Dare? You know, people are always saying, well, you know, I want to send you in a, a suggestion. Well, we call it the Dare John Letter. You can just comment here on the live feed. Put your comments there. Maybe maybe other people like the idea and start Good. pumping it Build it up, it up. You know? yeah. Second it. So, you know, yeah, that puts a lot of pressure on me to have to actually do it. And, you know, when you actually go buy this stuff and give it to me, I kind of feel like, well, i got to eat. i got to try. got to eat crickets because, you know. They gave them to me. That's right. So if you want to send me the actual whatever it is, you know, that's kind of a foot in the door and making sure your idea is, is featured here on the program, too. Um, but anyway, I guess I'm going to try. You, you wanted to try. I will be. You know, I'll save you one of these. I'm going to save you my last You're bite, the maybe. the star. But um, I've never eaten. I've, you know, I eat a lot of hot stuff on this program, sour stuff and stuff like that, stuff I kind of have an inclination to like. Kind of anyway. I mean, a lot of the stuff I've done is extreme to the max. Um, not not stuff I would eat on a normal non Tuesday night. Yeah. <laughs> but uh, you know, I don't. I've I've never been really attracted to the idea of eating bugs and worms and things like that. And the tarantula last week that was that was um big. That was big. You know. Um, but I I don't know this. This could be better. This could be worse. <gasps> it just moved. Did it really? Nope. <laughs> <laughs> All, right. All right. Down the hatch. Very oh. crunchy. Oh, and kind of that same kind of nasty, funky yuck flavor from the like the aftertaste of the tarantula. Ugh. Well, darn it. I mean, I don't taste. It doesn't taste like bacon and cheese and, <laughs> onion, and onion powder. Let's just. Throw that out there. Oh. oh God! It must be pretty uh, strong on these. Yeah, I don't like it. Here, try one. Well, yeah, I mean they don't have any smell. It's like they're dehydrated. Oh no, they're they're not dehydrated. Well, I mean I guess they're not hydrated. Maybe they are dehydrated. Maybe they naturally dehydrate after they die. I don't know what it is. Like we, we, I didn't do much research on this. Um, Four point three calories per serving, one serving per container, so they're not too bad. But only one point one gram of total carbohydrates. Good protein too. Zero percent fat. Point one five gram. Hmm. Point zero one four gram trans fat. Like how do they even know it to that fine of a measurement? Like you don't. I don't know. That's a whole other story. Mm -hmm. But, uh, here. 
<laughs> you gonna eat it? I'll eat it. Okay. All right. Rookie's gonna eat the uh, cricket. I'm gonna take his little leg off. I, I the drumstick. The drumstick yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's still there. Let's take his. Let's take his head off. Ooh, no, hey, I hey Crystal, I see your comment there. Hi. I don't normally get to see the comments What's live. <laughs> Crystal, um, I couldn't find the end sauce. I've got a. I got a variety of yeah, other other it. sauces here. Uh, some from Pepper Palace, the, the ghost mustard here. Maybe that might be good on them. Uh, but I looked for the sample of, of the end sauce that Crystal gave me. She And I'm going to do the end sauce, too. I'll uh, go up there and sign the waiver at Pepper Palace. It won't focus. Yeah, it's trying there to we go. That's focusing me. now. Are you going to eat another one? I'm going to eat that. I had this one. Oh, that's the same one yeah, still? I took, I took its leg and then its butt. <laughs> Put it in a blender and give it to scientists. <laughs> You don't like it? I mean, it's a bit like... I feel like... When I was a kid, I ate a leaf that tasted like this. Like, it's... It does have kind of an earthy... And even the texture is kind of similar. Like, it doesn't... It doesn't give. It's like accidentally eating a, a shrimp shell. Well, you know, and... You didn't shell the shrimp. It, it, it says... You a shell in your mouth. That's the feeling. That's the resistance. Is a shell. People with shellfish allergies. So it's uh, probably, you know, cousins or something of But the shrimp. taste is distinct. I mean, I recognize it immediately after that spider. Yeah, so you, you see what I'm talking about. You yeah. ate the, one of the tarantula legs. If the abdomen of the spider was more pungent, I'm surprised you did not throw up. Only thrown up once on the Dare John letter. And Another that, leg. We won't talk too much about that. Yeah. Uh, they're here at the end of it. Uh. <laughs> the legs weren't so bad. I guess it was the same way with the spider. The uh, legs, yeah, definitely. I would say the legs were the least worst part. There's absolutely no flavor to this except for the bug flavor, which, like we said, isn't that bad, but it's not good. It would be nice if there was, you know what, I can season this stuff myself from now on. We'll eat whatever bugs, but let me season it. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm, I'm good on the bugs after Maybe this. I mean, unless, unless somebody wants to send me some, uh, once upon a time, old, uh, Tony Coke, he told me he was going to send me some chocolate covered grasshoppers. I don't know if he's watching, but I'm, I'm still chocolate waiting on those chocolate covered grasshoppers. They can't be too far off from the crickets, right? But, uh, well, anyway, they're bigger. My, my my sister sent me a a, a dare earlier. Um, Ooh, there on the on looks the Facebook. fun too. I'm gonna eat the last two in one bite. She suggested a tablespoon of wasabi, and I I said I'm down for that. Well, she thinks it's gonna go up in my nose and my brain. I'm sure it's gonna go up your nose. You know, so I'm still working out parameters and stuff. And I'm not just supposed to eat it, and that's it. So it, she she said I should hold it in my mouth for. 20 or 30 seconds. I said, well, nah, why not 60? So she said, go for it. You should hold so, it in your mouth for 60 seconds and smear a little on your top lip. Smear it. <laughs> or just... No, 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 no. That's a bit <laughs> far. Your nasal cavity is a different kind of skin. But, um, anyway, so that'll be coming soon. And, uh, oh, um, I, you know, uh, somebody thinks that they can challenge me so, so oh so yeah so adrian alatore uh, an old buddy from back in Delonica days um he he's been watching the program and he tried to call me out he wants to have a taco eating contest and what hey normal tuesday night taco tuesday sounds good to me sounds a lot better than this so that's in the works too and uh i think we're gonna see who can eat a party pack from uh, taco bell the fastest and uh so anyway um be looking forward to that. I, you know, there's a few dares that's, that's been on the back burner. Uh, I, I kind of want to do. I kind of want to do them right. Kind of um, ideas. So stay tuned. Keep sending all the ideas. And uh, you know, maybe your maybe your creepy crawly gross thing will be featured on uh, the future episode. Trying to get it to focus on just one of these. Mm. Well, I'm gonna eat this there one. There we go. 
Jiminy Crickets. Oh, don't. No, poor Jiminy. <laughs> mm. Well, thanks for tuning in. And we'll see you next time. Love y'all. Have a good week. And remember, this is for fun. We like to have fun here. I hope, uh, hope it's fun for y'all. Uh, it does that like a leaf. It's kind of like just crunching up a, mm -hmm. a dry like fall not leaf. Fully, not fully dead. And, um, well, I think the bugs were fully dead. Well, the leaf. But, uh, anyway, um, this has been the Dare John Letter. We'll see you next normal Tuesday night. Yeah. Oh. Hold up. Wait, are we doing it again? Where's Big Ben when you need him? Oh. <laughs> Super promoter, MIA. What? Did no, you? That's the... Yeah. Mm -hmm. We're gonna we're gonna end this thing soon. Hello, my baby. Hello, my honey. Who wants to see a cat? <laughs> <laughs> there we go.